All right, welcome back to another Unity UI extensions tutorials. This one's going to focus on the scroll snapped controls. We have both the horizontal and the vertical snap controls. Now, the purpose of these controls is to actually have it so they can have pages of elements scrolling through the screen. And it's default option, it's full page, but you have full control over how big those dimensions are and how they should be presented. So look in the control, if we actually go to a project where I've actually got the assets installed already, and uh, we can simply go game object, UI extensions and let's go for the whoops let's go for the horizontal scroll snap. Let's have a look at that. And here's the control. Now as it stands up you've only got one page in. And if I run this you can see the fact that the one the one page takes up the full width of the actual world control is. To add more we simply have to take a look at the page. So we'll duplicate that a few times. Uh, we'll change the content to say page two and page ooh, let's see three now just by adding these the control automatically detects what's in there if you run it now we have page one and we can go left and go page two right and obviously can have keyboard controls to it and whichever it wants it's also scaled which actually works well with touch nice and easy if you want you can then also go and add some buttons so it goes the cameras it's had some buttons, so let's have two of them. So this one I'm going to call the next button. And this one we're going to call the previous button, just for fun. All we need to do then is then place on the screen where we actually want to have them. I'm really just going to throw these down in there. Now if we select the scroll snap control and have a look at the actual script, you'll see there's options here for next and previous buttons. So we take the next button, put in the next one, previous one in the <laughs> previous button. You can also do pagination of a few other things. Just experiment the control, see what you like. And then running on this now, if I connect on one button, it's going to go forward. The other one's going to go back. And I can't go past the beginning and I can't go past the end. Whichever way around you want to go it. Obviously, like this, you also then got the UI right, extensions vertical scroll snap which basically is the same control but just going vertically let's see if I move these around a bit for fun put it over there put this one over here and do the same again so we've got our pages do, do, do. a little bit of difference in this we actually tell what we're doing and next one number three I uh, run that, then obviously we've got one that goes left and right, and one that goes up and down. Whichever way you want, you want to do it. Obviously, you notice the fact that when you're running these now, obviously the control is going across the entire screen. If that's not what you want, then obviously, like any other UI control which has gra supports graphics, we can go and add a mask. Simple as that. And then now when we run it, you're only going to see the page within the page. Like anything else, nice and easy to use, very simplistic. Okay, so we hope you enjoy this control um, as well as every, all the other controls that are supported by the community. So if you like it and that's what you need, go and use it. If you need it to do something else a bit more, go ahead and tweak it. If you have a suggestion of how this would be changed or even a fix, then post it to the site and we'll actually get it included in the package for you. Hope you enjoyed this then. That's been another tutorial session for the Unity UI extensions.